In this video I'm going to demonstrate how to build a simple steam boiler system. Just like a hydronic system we just need to insert the boiler on the screen. Of course we have our steam toolbar up here therefore that's a steam boiler. Next thing I'd like to do is insert a a steam imposed load. Let me move that boiler over there a little bit. And then of course it's just a matter of connecting the, the icons to form the system. Now we can see we have the load connected to the steam boiler. The next thing we do is put a uh, trap in there because we need to have a trap in the condensate return. And finally we need to put a uh, some sort of a boiler feed and we'll just go ahead and stick a boiler feed tank in there and straighten that out a little bit. So we have a simple system formed there. To make this all work, we need to put a load in there. I'll put a thousand BTUs, or not, rather, thousand uh, pounds per hour, right in that that tab there. And now we can see the system works. Of course, uh, 80 psi steam that this uh, boiler is running at running at is usually not what you'd use for a, a load. So we'll go ahead and put a PRV there to reduce the pressure down. And then finally, uh, just go ahead and insert the steam pipe. Um, annotations right on there, the sizing, all that's right in there. So now we can see the, the system is all designed. We have a boiler, we have a PRV, a load, a, a trap, and the boiler feed tank. Finally, all we need to do is go ahead and push the little thumbs up button up at the top again. Say no because we don't want to look at all the equipment, and it'll pick the equipment. So if I want to look at the PRV, for example, go into selection there, we've picked a, a Spirex Arco PRV. We want to look at the steam trap, we can do the same thing and we picked an appropriate steam trap that will work in that situation. Uh, that's it. 